This week is the most productive, cozy week at home I have probably had ever. We are celebrating the first birthday of my home brand friend of mine with a little cake decorating class. It's so cute. Keaton's in town. We have a really good old rot day. I'm shooting for new product for a friend of mine drop, which is coming very soon. And we have a shoot day at home for my podcast house guest. And the quality is looking unbelievable. I'm so excited about it. So anyways, I hope y'all like this week in my life video with my new personality trait of being a sourdough loaf baker, if you will. And most importantly, our rot day at home. Hi y'all, welcome to another vlog. Today is actually Sunday. I normally don't vlog on Sundays, but it is the one year anniversary of a friend of mine, which is so exciting. And I'm having a little cake decorating class at my house, which is going to be so much fun. It's mainly the women of my family, and then like Macy, Tabby, Anna, like just like some really close friends. If y'all are new here, be sure to subscribe. This is a very exciting week. Keen's coming to visit. I'm excited. How many times can I say I'm excited? Okay. Hi y'all, happy Monday. I'm about to feed my sourdough starter. Look at her go. It's so exciting. I'm baking for the first time this week. It was 60 degrees this morning. My doors are open. I just went on a run after weightlifting at like 9.30 and it was 69, 68 degrees. Like I'm wearing a sweat set and it actually feels good. Like I'm not dying of heat stroke. I am so happy about this. Anyways, I'm going to feed my sourdough starter very quickly. I have therapy in like five minutes, which very needed right now. Yesterday was so much fun. And someone reached out to me to do like a wreath one, which I think would be so fun for a friend of mine. This is a very friend of mine heavy week. Um, we have a shoot for our new product. Keaton's actually coming to visit, which is gonna be so much fun. Okay, I'm gonna talk and feed while we're here. I need to move the rubber band up so we can track the growth. I made an entire like board on my shop my of everything that I use for sourdough. In case any of you guys wanna join along on the journey, I feel like so many of y'all are running right now, so many of y'all are starting sourdough. Like, we're, we're just all on the same page, on the same vibe. And here we go. I okay, also hired a video team for the podcast, so it's going to be so much better. I know I talk about that in like every single video, but I just absolutely hate, hate, hate. Just like the quality of video that we have right now, I just want it to be so much better. And I have such a vision for the show, especially in this home. And I was connected with this team, and I really think that they're going to get me there. I like them a lot. Okay. One half cup of organic, unbleached bread flour. I use the King Arthur brand. Um, I saw someone say that it's not necessary. It's like a more expensive kind. I didn't even realize it was a more expensive kind. I just got what someone else bought, so I didn't even realize that I didn't know anything about bread flour. Food for thought. If you don't want to spend that much, like, I've heard it doesn't matter. I didn't realize because I don't, I'm not familiar with bread flour. Quarter cup water. Today, it's a lot of computer work, especially before Keaton gets here. Here we go. The next couple of months are going to be crazy busy with so many shoots and launches and all that stuff. Podcasts, all the stuff. But I'm like mainly really just trying to stay home right now because this is my favorite time of year to be in Texas. Like it's football season. We're going to the Cowboys game on Saturday. So the 10K we've been training for, or we're going to the Cowboys game on Sunday. Also the 10K that we've been training for is on Saturday. 
I think I'm gonna do an entire separate vlog on my 10k running journey how I went from running not even being able to run two minutes to running a 10k I'm gonna like really really stir this around you want to make sure there's no flour left by the way this merch is available it's on the site so here we are it's a little messy on the sides I'm expecting this to like outgrow this space. I have a bigger jar that we're probably gonna end up having to move it to. Every day I use my recipe journal to update my log. So it's probably like 11 a.m. right now. Nine, nine fed day six. And then it's a half cup flour. I just think that this is helpful to have it all down. Recipe journals, guys, get yours now. All right, y'all, I'm kind of trying to organize my needle point right now. I haven't been needle pointing that much lately. It's just, it's a cold weather hobby and there was a slight breeze today. I have this Christmas one that reminds me of my Christmas tree. It's gonna be a really long project. I won't be getting this one done anytime soon. I actually did order a new penny line project last night. It's going to be a gift for someone. These like stretcher bars make life so much better. The problem is, no, that's not good. I'm packing up my bag. I am kind of eating a wall. Um, it's a Monday night, which means I'm going to my dad. It's Monday night football. Um, I go over there, we watch football, and need a well, I need a point, and watch football with him. I'm just adding in everything I'm going to need. If you guys are new to my channel, I really got into needlepoint last fall I want to say um and it's such a good like mindful hobby your hands are busy so you can't be on your phone you get really into it it's very therapeutic and then you're left with really cute things like one of my pillows this is actually my first project that was ever finished and all that means is it was made into something so even cowgirls get the blues I made this one I literally sat on that bed for 11 days straight I mean this was like peak grief I wasn't just normally doing this but for 11 days straight and I did this one. It doesn't even look like it's that big, but this canvas itself was this size. Like it was massive. Tonight, but I'm gonna bring my laptop over and get some work done. Prior to that, I also did this one. My sister is like obsessed with pigs. Like her whole life, she's just been like obsessed with pigs. I don't know, it's like her thing. And I found this canvas, but it was sold out. I'm trying not to get everything mixed up. Um, so I had it like custom made for me. All these by the way are hand painted. That's why you know point gets expensive. I had to get some stuff custom ordered because I needed to make this for her. Yeah, I'm really excited to like get back into the swing of things. I think it's gonna be really good for me. Um, and I need to give some stuff to my grandma because she's in the middle of finishing a couple projects. So that is that. I need what are my heels are. I also started this one forever ago and I love it. I just need to finish it. I'm going to eventually get this one framed. Maybe even for the, for the hosting closet. I don't know. But Update on the sourdough. It's probably like 3.30 p.m. now. And it has doubled. This is exciting. I think this means I can bake tomorrow. Okay. It's much later. And now I have an early run. So, oh, I got new pajamas. Look at how cute they are. Um, they're like really lightweight. They feel really good. Caitlin's coming tomorrow. So I need to wake up prep her room, doing all that stuff. Here's the progress that I made tonight. Basically, just here, if you guys can tell, like the seafoam color. I wanna do all of the seafoam, and then I don't know what I'm gonna go to next. This one's gonna be so fun because there's so much going on. It's 6.30, I'm running out the door for a four mile speed run. It's my last one, my long, like my last long run before the 10K. I'm meeting Tabby to go do this speed run. It's a four mile speed run. The rest of my runs are, I don't even, I think I might just do the one mile shakeout because Keaton's gonna be here, so we'll see. I think I have like one more like 25 minute recovery, which I did yesterday, but I do those all the time, so. Wish me luck, who would've thought?
incompetent. I really am red crumbs are gonna be like, and I'm very and they each other. As she so is of all. Hi y'all, back in our little sourdough station. I am so tired right now. Hey, I could sleep and need a point all day. But we can't do that. Anyways, I'm actually gonna move this sourdough to this just because it's bigger and then eventually what I'm gonna do I just got these two I'm gonna add all this to my shop mag you don't need all of these things now I'm realizing but I felt like I needed all this stuff when I started sourdough you don't but like these things have just been nice to have and also I'll use them regardless for like other stuff in my kitchen so I didn't really mind but I decided I'm gonna have one for discard and then one for sourdough starter like extra sourdough starters like god forbid if anything happened to this it would have back up and then i can just like gift that continue to make more and whatever so i also got this little like wooden stick because it'll be better to mix things you're not supposed to use any metal so i've been using like the plastic as you guys have seen this wooden spoon is so much easier this stuff just gets really sticky kind of a lot I think I'm gonna bake my first loaf on Thursday because Kate and I are gonna have a rot day, which is just incredibly important to us. And I'll be home all day, so I'll be able to like really pay attention. And I'm really excited for all of like the discard recipes as well. I didn't know if I was gonna like sourdough because I don't love baking, and obviously this is a lot more of like a baking thing. Update though, I really like this wooden stick. I'm gonna leave this kind of off, and hopefully this doubles in size today. I love this. I mean, I haven't baked yet, so we'll see then, but I love it. We've graduated to a much larger jar. Guys, it's been an hour, and look at that growth. I need to get my nails done because we are shooting tomorrow, and these look bad. Maybe not. They do in person. We have a photo shoot, and I have three podcast episodes tomorrow, and I'm getting my car wash. My, least, my two least favorite chores, but we're getting them done. I got my car wash. It feels like I have a new car and my nails done. I'm so glad I did that. Guys, Keaton has arrived. It's actually like 8 p.m. We've been sitting here talking, but look at my sourdough and how much it's grown. That's actually insane. My AC is out. We were just sitting outside and I just got attacked by mosquitoes and I'm like jumping. Like my feet hurt so bad, but video is all set up for tomorrow. It's all good to go. Really exciting. The podcast is going to be so incredible. I'm really, really pumped. Guys, it's time to pick out some outfits. Look at how cute you look in here. I'm like so cozy. It looks like you're meant to be. Yeah, I'm really cozy and I'm I'm really cozy and I'm also really toasty. I need to pick out my outfits for tomorrow. So I have a friend of mine shoot. Keaton's coming to tomorrow. Um, but I have to have three outfits for the podcast and two for the shoot. And I think I have the two for the shoe. Um, life is just so much better with AC. And I would just like to take a moment of gratitude that for every other day of my life that I spent with AC. Because we could have, like, been watching Halloween movies. Your kids just like, do you want a sauna tonight? Like, no, well, no we didn't like, even actually need to turn it off. <laughs> like, <laughs> we, really really like, we literally didn't even need to do that. Because <laughs> actually, God took that question a little bit seriously. <laughs> no, we really did. Yeah, God was like, sure, girls. Like, Snatch the AC immediately from us. Yes, I was wondering, oh, it's the flowers. I'm like, what's on this floor? I'm like so crazy about having clean floors. Like, it drives me insane. Yeah, I and, can't walk around barefoot ever. No, like, this is driving me crazy. And, like, my beautiful floral arrangement, like, it's dying. But I didn't want to, like, get rid of it until Keaton saw it. So now I can get rid of it, but it's too late. Anyways, here's my outfit. So we're going to see. We're going to see what works. Look at my outfit. Like, jacket. Isn't that so, like, Grandma Gardener? Oh, my God. Wait, wait. Is this what you're wearing tomorrow? No. Oh, this is so cute. No, I just have it up here. It's just giving Grandma Gardener. This is my this, I, I knew jacket. this was your jacket. This was, yeah. Perfect. I'm isn't almost it? positive I have the same one. These go for a lot of money. I have out? the same one. They we were trying to find some for like last season. Oh my dad's. Yeah, they're expensive. Mm -hmm. Like actually the crazy. The vintage ones go yeah. for a lot. It just looks so like really exciting no uh, noise. Really? <laughs> what? Really exciting news? Um, well now this isn't really gonna fit here, but we'll have to figure it out. I don't know. My belts have arrived, or the rest of my belt organization, and yeah, it is a little odd that they're a little high up, but I like being able to see them next to all my clothes and having them all here. And then I did organize my bags a little bit and I put some more in the closet. 
This is more just like everyday jewelry. Actually, this is the necklace you got me, Keaton. Oh, I haven't seen that it. That took in real like life. six months to come in. Keaton was like having a heart attack about it. No, it like actually took like nine it's, like, months really to come cute. in. Like I'm pissed. It's really cute. So we have that. Oh, it looks so cute. It's My, you know, it's like so perfect. Um, okay, well, that's not really working, but I really like this for belt organization. Believe it or not, I did have a couple more, but these are what made the cut. I have a belt collection on TikTok, and I also have all, literally all of these linked on my shop my. These all are Seven Hills, by the way, but love them. Actually, yeah, I'm pretty sure they're all Seven Hills. Guys, look at this fit. I'm wearing this jacket with matching shorts to the Cowboys game this weekend, but like, oh, it's really cute. so perfect. Jack yeah. was so proud of me. <laughs> It's perfect, and honestly, I'm not wearing anything under it. Yeah, I mean, you don't have to, don't and to. you don't have to die. Yeah, and it'll be like a happier time for everyone involved. <laughs> like, I'm so happy for everyone who's going to well, experience this. it's going to be a really happy time right now. Oh, yeah, guys, they just arrived, and we're really happy. Yeah. We're really, really happy. I'm, um, I'm begging. This, I'm so glad I did this tonight. So glad you said that, because, yeah, yeah, I feel so much better. Now it's prepared. You're good. All good, the outfits are picked. Good to go. Good morning, y'all. Um, we are making our coffee. And you know I have a Halloween cup. So which one would you like? Okay, I'm feeling. We have bats, we have skulls, and we have pumpkins. I'm feeling batty. <gasps> Cute. Bat. bat for the batty. Yes, I love, love that. Her. My nieces, uh, with their friends, is called the Batty. Wait, that's literally they're nine. So <laughs> nine. I know. It's so funny. Okay, so unfortunately, there was no cookie butter creamer at Sprouts yesterday, which is uh, really. Upset. A hard pull for me to swallow because I've been waiting to come here and try the cookie butter creamer. I think that we might have luck today. I don't know why it's suddenly it's like out of the top. I was thinking this is going to be a departure from your barista ways. This oh my god, no. But I like your coffee. Whenever I see you make your, co your coffee on TikTok, you know, you know when something looks good and you know it looks you good. You know. Yeah, you just know. This is my favorite iced coffee besides there's one coffee at Farms. Uh, no, it's California, like California, because I always so said that weird. too. And then, like when I work with them, like obviously, they but like you how to no one it. says it like that. So you yeah, sound, so weird. and then I'm like, I sound like a pretentious prick. That's how I feel you know? whenever I say L'Occitane now. Yeah, well, when you said that yesterday, I'm like, oh, that's how you pronounce it. Because they made me watch a YouTube yeah, that's video, what I do for and I had to watch it for like. So yeah. like, and every time I pronounce it, people are like, you know, that's wrong. And I'm like, I'm no. not trying to be rude, but like, I, I, I actually know the brand. And so. I know that I don't have a French accent, so it sounds really bad. Yeah. <laughs> have you ever had this creamer though? Yes. No, this, this is, is so, so good. good. Oh my God. I have that one and I use, I like hazelnut. Oh my God. Hazelnut is like my favorite flavor. The hazelnut yeah. is so I love the hazelnut good. too. So I good. really like the sweet cream and it's weird because I don't like super sweet. Oh, I stuff. do. So. But I love it. Like, I, well, like, clearly I do because it's a cookie butter, but those, like, aren't too sweet to me. Yeah. You know? Just wait. I have my last straw. straw. <gasps> See, I need to. I'm not going to show this. I'm just, like, staring at it because oh, I you really am obsessed with this. Oh, yeah. <gasps> it's this so exciting. is so cute. Oh, my God. I need this in my house. Like, oh, yeah. Those are the new ones. No, these are they're really cute. so cute. <gasps> Oops, sorry. <laughs> Did you see the other one? There's two. Yeah, this yeah. one. Yeah. But that yeah. coloring, both, that's a little, it's going to be more like that coloring. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm not doing those. They just sent me the wrong product. Oh, wait, you're not making. Okay, cheers. Well, we need to mix. Don't oh, forget. Just kidding. Just kidding. Mix. Oh. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Tomorrow, we're having a raw day, and we're going to watch. Um, Halloween movies all day, and we're gonna bake chili or cook chili, and we're gonna turn the fire on. Yes, we're gonna. I'm gonna. Oh, since the AC is working, <laughs> and I just want to say, like, I just want to practice gratitude this morning that I have working AC. Okay, here's the thing, guys. The kids you really got it done though. No, and like I was really stressing because like that could have affected my sourdough starter like majorly. Like it, sometimes it's like if it gets too cold, it won't rise or something. I don't know. It's how I'm trying to be. Oh my god, sour. Does it smell bad? Yeah, like oh, sour, like yeah. I don't like wait. That. This is so interesting to me. But I mean, this is what I can't figure out, and I should just ask TikTok actually because it would be faster. I haven't discarded yet. Today I'm discarding. I moved to like a bigger jar because I want to have a backup starter, and then I want to discard in my fridge. So I know I have so much, but then do I just get it down? Because then you're supposed to do like a one 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 feed, but every day it's going to be that much, and I'm not going to be baking every day. So how do I get to like a lesser feed? Do I just Get most of it out. 
You guys see what I'm saying? I don't know. I actually should make a TikTok about this today, like literally right now because I feel like someone will know what to someone do. will know and I'm just like I've never made sourdough and lost. No, like it's gonna be something. But this I... is like insane. Wait, actually while we're here, the vlog this up. No, the bread's cute. Ready. It's the bread so, is cute. so cute. And then oh, you know what? I didn't even good. I was like, I think hopefully those aren't burnt. Like this. No, I'm obsessed. Is so cute. The top of it. And then I'll just like, oh my god. It's gonna be amazing. No, I'm what very excited if, for the sourdough journey. What if I shock everyone on my first looks? Perfect. I feel like you probably will. I don't think like so. I, I feel like you're good at picking up stuff like that. I'm actually not good at baking. I'm good at okay. cooking because it's not exact. Yeah, and sourdough I'm not is gonna very exact. Either. But it doesn't feel like baking because when I think baking, it feels like a treat. That's why it's like intimidated me. Like I'm like, what? Yeah. What is that? Well, now like, I really what is. No, that? I've been intimidated for so long. Honestly, it was just that like <gasps> it was such a me thing to have done, and the fact that I hadn't did, done it, like I needed to give it a shot, yeah. and I didn't think I was gonna like it. But there was something about that first feed routine that really got me. <laughs> <laughs> and I went through. No, like I was filming a video, and I'm like, I don't think I'm gonna like this. And then two minutes later, I'm like, I love this. My life is changed. Yeah, that's crazy. My world is different. Like. It's crazy. Yeah, exactly. I'm so in love with this outfit. Um, it'll be linked on my shop. My this is Glassens. Um, it has it comes with matching shorts, which I'm gonna wear this weekend and then these low-rise Abercrombie jeans these heels We're about to start It's amazing I'm talking about it and now it's just so much better. So anyways, I just love like this is one of all my favorite Yeah, literally. Wow, we just finished recording. The new setup looks unbelievable. Oh my god. And Fitch just, he's posing for his shot. Oh, big yawn. Okay. And it might look different in pose. All right, guys. It's later, we had a great, successful recording day. And now we have a photo shoot. We're at Sprouts. We're gonna just get some treats, just some props. Snacks. Just some little snacks. Like, <laughs> out we go. Alright y'all, we are halfway done. We just did all the pictures of me and Keaton are just Keaton solos and we are about to do um, the group lectures. My sister is here. My cousin Alyssa is here and it's going to be so cute. Maddie just had me take photos of her with these flowers. That she got me. Yep, yeah, sure. Happened. It's crazy. Um, this backyard is insane. Like it's so stunning. Yeah. Good morning, y'all. It is officially our rot day, which a little background, Kate and I we love a good rot day. It's just it's our favorite way to spend time together. A rot day. We actually recorded our podcast episode on how to have like the perfect rot day. But basically, we don't leave the house and we just hang out. We typically will have an activity. For some reason, we bake pies together. Neither of us like to bake. Like I don't know where that came from. Um, and we like to watch documentaries and movies and order food in. And like Kate and I have spent like at at least 20 weekends together like so much time just like visiting each other and we like don't leave so anyways we're gonna have our rot day today which we are so excited for and today i am pumped because i'm gonna be working on my noodle point project and i'm making my first i'm making my first loaf of sourdough i'm doing the like same day method which i'm gonna write the whole recipe out in my recipe journal anyways it rose yesterday it doubled i I'm going to discard some of this and then we're going to feed it. And then today, later, we will be baking sourdough. We're gonna see how my first loaf goes. I don't have high hopes. Um, I'm really you know, prepared for it to be bad. We're also gonna be chilly today. Like, it's just the perfect fall cozy day.
Yeah. No, no, actually not. So Caitlin was just sitting here, and then she had to leave for a second. And said, "Fitz, don't move." But he was sitting there. He not only took her spot, he's also sitting on her heating pad. Like him tucked in the blanket, he literally came, sat right on my heating pad. He's like, mm, "This is really cozy." He's like, "Wait, I like this." I meant like. Like stay so I can cuddle back in my spot. Yeah. Not like, you know. You can just tell him to move. Wait a minute. He's just so happy. Look, he loves it. He's just so cozy. <laughs> I'm like, it's a fall day, it's fine. He's so crazy. We're rotting. Look at him. He's so crazy. Like he's like so cute. No, he is so I mean he you just don't understand how perfect he is until you're with him in person like, too. Like it's one thing when you see him in videos and photos, it's another when you experience him. No one understands. No one understands. Like, whenever I see you post him, like my heart like it hurts because yeah. I'm happy with him. Yes. Like, <laughs> He's so perfect. Okay, so guys, I'm showing this to Keaton right now. Since I plan to, you know, perfect my sourdough, I am eventually going to you know start gifting it to people also i pull my hair up and i feel so much better about my life um start gifting it to people so i did get some sourdough bags you can see over here it came with stickers which got me thinking i'm gonna get custom stickers made and they're probably on vista print this would be a great brand deal for vista print but i have these sourdough bags to oh put God. everyone's loaf in them and these say hey i would love to get you know they could be better Okay, so it's gonna be like Kinsey sourdough. So I've got to figure that out today. Kinsey, that's so cute. Isn't that cute? I mean, yes. Sure, I've not baked one successful loaf. No, it's just so funny. It's so weird. <laughs> yeah. Keaton, when she got into Pilates, she was saying that she went on like dancer websites. It was getting all the stuff, like the leg warmers, all the outfits, everything. I have like 12 different pair of leg warmers with like matching like leotard and skirts. Yep. I have never worn to Pilates ever. You could wear them. No, I'm like embarrassed. Like I'm actually embarrassed. I'm no, like, I think it came. What was I thinking? Keen, if anything, like you should you're in LA. You should definitely wear them. Like you're fine. Oh, it's so bad. Uh, hey, LA has seen crazier, I promise you that. No. Like that people everyone's gonna be like, oh my god, you're so cute. And then it's gonna be like Pilates fashion. No, I know. But it's just out of control. Oh my God. Like it's one thing and like makes it the whole personality, you know? The entire personality. And what's the point of liking things if not to make it another personality trait? 100%. You know what I mean? Yeah. Okay, y'all, so here is my little setup. We're about to get started. I just performed the float test, and here's the thing. I, like, I'm hoping this is ready. It has doubled, and there are bubbles. I just performed the float test. It seemed fine. So I feel like we're good. Like, I feel like this is at its peak, because it did start here this morning, and it's up to here. So I feel like it's fine. We're watching Twitches, and I'm doing an eight-hour sourdough bread recipe. I got this from the Sourdough Moms TikTok. Um, if you guys are interested, you can. it just pops right up. I've watched that video 15 times. She doubles it, so that's why these are in like half increments. I just made, I'm obviously only making one loaf. And then over here, we have my new sourdough baking pan that you guys already know all about. So this is so exciting. I cannot wait. It's gonna be a long day. Too late? Uh, no. Let's see if it falls out naturally, which it's supposed to do. No. It does take a minute on TikTok. I've okay, seen. I see it kind of dipping. But it doesn't seem to be dipping. I see oh, it. it. Is. I it see is. it. it is. Yeah, I can see it from my end. It's, Whoa, definitely, it's falling. definitely falling. It's falling just a little slow. slow. <laughs> it's not really giving what it needs to be giving. <laughs> it's really not. 
This is crazy. <laughs> like, what is it gonna do? Okay. So, the dough is definitely not ready, but like. <laughs> Like you think it needs to sit longer? No, like not. It's from earlier. Like I think I probably should have started later. This is insane, Keaton. Like, no, it's going really slow. about to put the sourdough in the oven listen like this first off it's my first loaf it's going to be a flop the first couple will be okay this one definitely is but I think I figured out like what I did in the process and I probably should have waited to even start so anyways how cute I'm still gonna bake it because I just want to see like how it actually turns out and just you know get my reps in this is the recipe that I've used from sourdough mom on tiktok Kate and I are watching The Perfect Wife. It's crazy, she's seen it before, but it's actually insane. Did you finish your book yet? I just did. <gasps> How are you feeling? I'm feeling stressed and I'm downloading the next one. Yep, I had, wait, I thought that next one was the... I thought that I packed the huge oh. one and I guess I didn't, so I'm super upset. Yeah, wow, well, all that for I'm nothing. It, but it's yes. Better, yeah, that's true. Guys, Keaton has this book <laughs> that is Literally, I mean, it's the biggest book I've ever seen in my entire life. Like, it's actually crazy. All that for nothing. All that for nothing. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Way better than I was expecting for my first loaf. Like way, way, way better. I'm shocked it even looks like this. Guys, <laughs> does that say E4 up there or is it E1? Because that's E5, but I feel like they're a little E4. Oh, E4 okay, is right so here. this is that's okay. perfect. Wow. We're dropping Keaton off. Time for me to go. Wait, I had so much fun. <laughs> such a good time. This is such a good trip. So much rotting, so much stuff done. So much TV, so much So fits. much TV. <laughs> so much fits. Guys, Fitz followed us. He never does this. He followed out to the car today, and he tried to get in it. Like, he wouldn't leave. I had to take him inside myself. Like, normally he listens, and I'm like, inside. He goes inside. No, no. no he wanted to come with. He's devastated. He's devastated. You when broke I was his heart. When I was packing my bag, he was literally putting his paw on it, and I was like, I'm going to sob. Like, I will sob. He really. hates to see a suitcase. No, he hates it. Hates it. I close my room now whenever I pack. I know, I felt bad. It. I was like, he knows what's happening. No, he's like, I can't believe this. I'm going to come home, he's going to be devastated. He's going to be, like, sulking oh, on the chair. he's going to be sad. <laughs> Poor guy. Well, Miss Fitz, Miss Coco, um, gotta really... run. My sister's in labor. <laughs> yeah, so she's gotta go. Okay. Bye. Bye, guys. Okay. Love you. Bye. All right, y'all. It's Friday, and I was supposed to work out today, but and get some stuff done. This weekend, I have so much going on. It's time to test. We're gonna cut open the loaf. I have not much hope at all. I do want to say that. I'm expecting this to take me a couple tries. See? It's a little hard. Okay, like it's just... <sighs> Guys, I am going to lose it. No fucking way. 
I thought this was gonna be so much worse. Like, this looks good to me. I mean, you literally cannot tell me anything. My ego is through the roof. I mean, first loaf. <laughs> I am in shock. I mean, oh my god, guys. I mean, I have literally never been cockier in my life. Like, I'm gonna taste test this and tell you guys if I think it's good. I just heated up some chili. Yes, it's like 9 a.m. But that's just me. I didn't have parchment paper, which was kind of the issue, so that's why it's like hard to cut through the bottom. It's not burnt, but this looks normal to me. Really warm, but I just created a monster in myself. It is so good. Macy's gonna die. Guys, I texted Macy maybe, maybe 20 minutes ago, and she's here to taste test. If there's one thing I'm good at in this life, like I can taste test. Like, yes. I. Wait, 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 I need you to like, over dramatize. Like, when you. Wait, can we do a TikTok? Yes! 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 <laughs> okay, wait, yes, yes. So, should I go to the. I'll just go to the audio. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, like, that's true friendship, guys. Oh, really? Macy, Big Ben. Did you have butter? No, yeah, and by the way, I actually just put some out for you. Oh my gosh. Because I ran out of butter and I put it in my little butter dish. I was literally gonna, like, bring some Kerrygold. Wow. Okay, why isn't this? I'm literally so tired. I have so much to edit today. I'm like, I'm sitting and I'm not leaving my house. Yeah. I'm literally about five. I haven't drink any water. I really don't feel good, I'm gonna be honest with you. Dude, I, I really actually don't feel good. I didn't good. either. I was really panicking yesterday. I had the wellness formula every three hours. I still have three in my pocket because I don't have it till I eat. I went to bed at 10, which is unheard of for me. Went to bed at 10, woke up at 8. I feel a lot better today. I went to bed early and I still am. Like, I just, my legs feel like queasy. No, I felt really queasy today. Okay, I'm in front of her. Okay, are you ready? Something for me, yeah. Um, but it's watch out, but it's fine. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, go. TikTok that we just had to love the That's amazing. <laughs> okay, we'll go back to our TikTok vloggers. There's a lot of content happening right now, but like, no, and I'm so sorry. I it is like it is what it is. I have been a very busy work day and totally. I'm, nope. Clearly, me too. No, like, what do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I toasted it. Now everything's technicolor. Don't I look put together? Yeah. I wonder why. It's the little things. Um, no, actually, Jack's gonna love your rugby shirt. Oh, this is one I already had. Cute. But look, this is, I texted her yesterday. Um, Guys, Jack is styling Macy now too. She's feeling good about that it. That is insane. You know, isn't that crazy? Not to brag, but first loaf, okay? Okay. Here we go. Um, I didn't have parchment paper, so like this is the bottom's tough. That's okay. Because it's like should be burned, but it's, it, it didn't even burn. That's how crazy it is. That's insane. But yeah. Like. I have seen, because I follow so many people that have been mm -hmm. doing sourdough, I've seen so many first loaves. Yeah. Mm hmm. Did you see that someone did a, a Nutella one? No. There's a Nutella. I keep saying jalapeno cheddar because that's going to be so good when you like roll it in. And that's like easy to do. Well, I got this sourdough loaf for actually. Um, one of y'all DM'd me to get this book and I ordered it immediately and it came that day. Yeah. And I was reading like through this last night. But I've just done so much research when it comes to sourdough. I've learned so much in the past two weeks. Oh, will you hold her for one second? I am on so much sourdough TikTok. No, like my sourdough TikTok is like out of control, but I want to do like cinnamon raisin too. Do you hate raisins? No. I just feel like you would. No. I, I think it's because I've said how I don't love trail mix. Like sometimes when it's mixed together, I'm not obsessed, but I love like cinnamon raisin bagel. Yeah. I, oh, that might gosh. be one. And I think it's also just because stuff like, I think it's because like kids don't like raisins typically or something. Yeah, like it's more of a. You're just more youthful. The Big Ten K tomorrow, guys. I'm, I'm, so I'm doing a whole separate video. I'm doing a video, a vlog on the 10K, and the video is gonna be like how my running journey. But like, it's not gonna be in this vlog. Um, how are you feeling? Good. I'm not gonna be ready with Kenzie. She's a lot faster than you. No, if you do like 11:30, I'll do it. 
But I can't, I can do 1130 for three miles and that's it. And I want to be able to like keep running. So I think I should start slow. And that's why I'm like, we can't go. Yes. Well, maybe we will. Maybe, maybe I'll be like, I'm feeling not my not yeah. today. We'll see. I mean, Macy, like, actually, guys, this is insane. Macy started running a month ago. Like, I started running months ago, and, like, it took me, like, months to get to five miles. But here's the thing. Like, if you want to, like, get it, like, if you want to do it, like, sign up for a race. Because I was like, yeah. oh, my God, I can't not. She's done, like, crazy, like, crazy, crazy well. And to be honest, I still don't know if I can do it tomorrow. Like, I have never, I barely ran five miles. Like, I, it was bad. No, it wasn't. It was good. Hey, I need to show you this. <laughs> I don't even know if I mentioned in this week's vlog, but I now have a Jacobus code. It's Kenzie 10. So I legally want to change my name to Kenzie 10, my Jacobus code. And now I'm Kenzie, then I was Kenzie Sourdough Piper, now I'm Kenzie 10 Sourdough Piper. And Macy is, because I posted my Strava workout and someone was like, thank you so much for posting your realistic mile time. <laughs> and I was like, that is giving like, Thank you so much for posting, like, and not, like, and I never see my body type. No, like, what you, you make me so confident. Yeah, like, you make, yeah, you're, you you're inspire me your confidence. So, yes, you inspire me, and it's like, you're, you're just wearing clothes, and they're just like, it's like a backhand. And I was like, and I was like, wait, that's my goal, is to be a voice for everyone. Like, a voice to the people. And so, yeah, I'm Macy Realistic Mile Time Thompson, love hanging out around the 12 minute mark. Um, yeah. No, hang with me, I should be a pacer. The next one. I'm the 13 minute pacer. 13 minute pacer with all of your people. Yeah. <laughs> yes. My army of slow runners. <laughs> okay, That's guys. Not even slow. Have you seen me like not being able to focus because I'm just staring no, at I the know. toaster? I'm like, I'm like, make uh, sure you know what, what. Yeah. Toast, like a level of toast is just so personal. No, it is more personal than anything. Okay, I know I said first twice, but like, I don't know how. Thank mm -hmm. you.